Hello so guys, today I'm going to show you how you can go ahead and install your updates on the PS5 with using a USB flash drive like you see. So first of all, what you want to do is you just want to go ahead and make sure that your PS5 is off. And you want to make sure that this yellow light over here is also turned off. So if you see some yellow or orange light, how you want to call it, you just want to go ahead and open up your PS5 back. So let me do that really easily. And also guys, make sure that you have the USB cable. So make sure it's connected with your controller. So let's go ahead and open it up. And now what you can do is if you get like this yellow light or rest mode, you just want to log in. Let's press next. And what you want to do is you just want to go ahead and go to the quick menu. Let's do that. Go to here, power, and then turn off. Make sure that you turn off. Not Don't, don't guys, don't go to rest mode. So let's turn it off. And guys, if it goes to rest mode, if it's gives you like orange light again, what I suggest you guys to do is unplug your cord and then plug it back in. And then you also wanna wait till the white light over here stops blinking. So once it stops blinking guys, you're done. So now what you can basically do is you can go to save modes. So what you wanna do is you just wanna go to the power button over here and you wanna keep holding. Keep holding till you hear two beeps. Here you go. Oops. But never mind. Let's open up our HDMI. And also, guys, if it doesn't work, what I suggest you guys to do is if you're using like a, a switch or a game capture card, just plug that uh, just plug that out and then just plug a HDMI that is directly connected with your TV or monitor to your PS5. So now what you want to do is press on the PS button. And make sure it's connected with your PS5, guys, or it's not working. Now, what you can do is you can go over to here. Update system software. And now, what we want to do is just leave it on here. And now, let's go over to our PC. So, just plug your USB flash drive in. Here you go. And also, guys, I just want to tell you. If you recently connected with your internet, you can also do just the same with using your internet connection. So you don't have to get like USB drive. Now what you wanna do is you just wanna open up a Chrome tab and then you wanna search up this over here. Let me show you. Just reinstall system software over here. And I'm gonna search up English. The reason why is it just gives me another language, English. So let's do that. So on here, just type on here, just click on here, I mean. And now what you wanna do is you wanna go down and you wanna go over to download PS5 update file. Click on here and it should give you an update here. If it doesn't give you anything, guys, what you wanna do is you wanna right click and then click on link open, the first option. And then it gives me an option to download it like you see. So sometimes I actually had that problem before. So if you get that problem, it also happens on um, the reinstall file over here. So if you want to download one of these, you just want to go ahead and right click and go to the first option here. And that's how you can fix it if it doesn't download. Now let's just wait till it downloads. I'm gonna just skip a little bit forward. So guys, while it's downloading, what you wanna do is you just wanna go ahead and go to your file explorer. Just open it up from here. And then what you wanna do is you just wanna go to your USB drive. So what you wanna do is basically, if you have some files on your USB drive, what you can basically do is just drag, select them all and then just drag them over to your desktop. The reason why basically is we are gonna delete and format our USB drive. 
but I'm not gonna do it on this one. I'm gonna do it on my extra USB drive that I actually connected. So what you wanna do is you just, you just wanna go ahead and go to your USB drive, right click, go to format. Once you go to here, what I recommend you guys to get is FAT32. If you cannot get FAT32, you can also try out XFAT. But if this doesn't work out, guys, if it doesn't show any updates or whatsoever, what you can also do is you can just format it as a FAT32. So let's do this for right now because I only have this as an option. So let's click on start and click on quick format over here. And like it says, guys, it will delete everything on your USB drive. Let's click on the yes, format complete. And now let's open it again and then you will be done. So let's see, did it update yet? It's still downloading. So let's go back. So once you're done with downloading, guys, you just wanna go over to your downloads and drag your file out. So let me do that really simply. Here we go. And I already have a file, so I don't have to do it again. So let's just close it off. And now what you can do, will, what you can actually do is you can just go ahead and open up your ESP. Let's do that over here. This is our formatted drive. So what we want to do is we just want to go ahead and right click and go over to new and go over to folder. We want to create a new folder named PS5. And guys, you have to do the same as I do or it will not work. So just create a folder named PS5. And then click on here and then make another folder named update. Make sure it's in capital letters like this. So once you're done, click OK. And now what you want to do is you just want to go ahead and drag the file. So let me open that really quickly. Another one over here. So right click, open a new file. And then I'm just going to drag it. Here we go. So now it will just copy it into my drive. And once it's done guys, it will just work great. So let's just wait a bit more. And by the way guys, if you please could like and subscribe, thank you so much. So once it's done guys, what we wanna do is we just wanna go ahead and plug our USB drive out. So now it's basically done. So now what you wanna do is you just wanna go ahead and plug it out. And then you just wanna go ahead and go to here. So what you wanna do is I will suggest you guys to plug your USB flash drive in the back of your PS5. So on the back of your PS5, you can also plug some USBs and stuff like that in. So do it on the back. And once you do that, guys, you can go ahead and use your USB drive to update your PS5. And that's how simple it basically is. And what if it doesn't work, guys? What you can also do is format it as a FAT32. So that could be also a reason why it doesn't work out for you. And yeah, that's basically it, guys. So let me go ahead and go back. I don't need to update. That's why I'm not doing it. But this is how you can do it. I tried it already on my PS5 and also my PS4. It does work for me. But like I said, guys, if it doesn't work, try FAT32. And if you cannot open safe mode, basically maybe you are using like a switch or using something like a game capture card. It could work out. Or maybe you are just in rest mode. Like if your PS5 gives you like a yellow or an orange light coming out of here, what you want to do is just plug out the cord and plug it back in and that's how you can fix it and then go back to safe modes so yeah that's how simple it is so let me show you my name so guys if you want to add me here's my name let's go to my profile over here and here you go you can just add me here is my name just kiri 
and you can also follow me at Twitter and Instagram. The link will be in the description. And also guys, please drop a like and subscribe to the like, she helped me out so I can make more videos so I can help more people out. So thanks for watching guys. If it didn't work out, you can drop it in the comments down below. If it did work out, you can also drop it in the comments down below and comment down below. When did you get your PS5? Take care guys.